Jurassic Outfitters. Can't wait till the new movie comes out. So that was a fun ride. It dumps you out through the store. Another great marketing ploy that Disney came up with a long time ago. Dump the rides through the store, sell the merchandise. You okay? Yeah, they're just freaking out because I'm soaking wet thinking, you didn't get all that from this ride, did you? No. No, three water three rides in a row. We're done. All right, let's give it to the hair. You want to eat? Okay, so we're going to the uh, Thunder Falls. Barbecue ribs, burgers, rotisserie chicken, the whole thing. So they're in line right now. It's kind of a kind of a buffet, not a buffet line, but you go through, you pick everything you want. Uh, good barbecue. They got turkey legs in here too. Turkey legs are huge uh, in this park. And uh, that's about it. So I'm getting Tammy, Tammy's getting a burger and ribs for me to review. So we try the barbecue, see if it's any good, and see if their meat's any good for the burgers. Okay guys, so here's a shot of the uh, the ribs that Jack got. Looks like a half rack, I'm guessing. Okay, what are the same ribs, right? We got the same yeah, thing, yeah, Jack? Same, same thing. Yeah, same Alright, so here's more. Oh wow. Look at that. That's beautiful. This is what their burger looks like. Let's get a shot of this. Not a bad amount of meat on that. Just get it over on the patty a little bit. Uh your basic bacon burger. Okay, you got what? Rotisserie chicken salad. Right there. And then what's this? That is a chocolate chip brownie dessert. We pulled right off. Mom, ketchup. Right there. Ketchup. When you make your ribs, the bone shouldn't slide out. It should come clean off the bone, but it should be adhered to the bone until you're ready to grab it. Perfect ribs here. Wow. Okay, so um, I would say the ribs were like amazing. They were totally amazing. Uh, worth the price for a music park. I'm very surprised. The burger was uh, good taste. Tammy said the salad was awesome. So uh, I'm going to let Jack Jr., he's washing his hands right now. I'm gonna let him kind of sum it all up when he gets back. Because he had some really cool words to say and I wanted to capture it on video. So when you guys come here, you'll try this place out. What's up, dude? Not much. Uh, I'd like to thank Universal for not being money-hungry scumbags like Disney. Because Disney just rips you off and doesn't doesn't do anything. It's the happiest place on earth, but really it's the most miserable place on earth. This, these people should be the happiest place on earth because everything here has been amazing. Our employees are happy. The people are actually happy. Like we didn't see one dude smiling yesterday when we were in Mexico area. Uh, and it was just, it's just amazing so far. The rides are awesome. Everything's just organized and the food's pretty good. So this is way better than a Disney park? Oh yeah, definitely. The only thing Disney needs to do is two things. They just need to take a seat and start taking notes from these people. Alright man. Okay, so we're going on more rides? Oh yeah, definitely. Alright, looks like we are entering ha uh, Hog Hogwarts or it's called Hogs Hogsmeade. Is that what it's called? Looks like they got butterbeer going here. Interesting. Never seen a butterbeer before. I wonder if it's just from the movie or butterbeer is real. Oh, it's a trademark. What else we got here? Oh, where'd the family go? Again, they, I lost them again. Okay, so this the uh, the Hogwarts ride. Look at this. Look at all these warnings. Heart condition, expected mothers, fear of heights, medical sensitivity to fog effects, recent surgery or other conditions that may be aggravated by this ride, back, neck, or similar physical conditions, motion sickness or dizziness, medical sensitivity to strobe effects, fear of enclosed spaces. Okay, that got me. Here's the entrance to Hogwarts Castle. Uh, it's a ride, it's like an hour, hour wait and they do not have the uh, VIP pass on this. And then over here is Flight of the Hippogriff. And this is just kind of a small little roller coaster. Are these Hogwarts themed drinks? Uh, the pumpkin juices and the gilly water. Like the gilly water and the pumpkin juice? Very cool. And what is in the pumpkin juice? It's real pumpkin? It's mostly apple juice. And, uh, 
it'll taste like a pumpkin pie. Nice. Yeah, it's really yummy. In Chadwick Bay, is that kind of a English? I would imagine so. Beverage. I'm not totally sure. Have you drank any of these? I've had the pumpkin juice. Um, right. And obviously the gilly water is just better. Right. I've had our sweet tea in the restaurant. I don't know if it's the same brand as the bottle, but I haven't tried the tea. Oh, very cool. The pumpkin juice is fantastic. How much is the sweet tea? Four twenty-five. Okay, so they got the whole neighborhood going on here. Tomes and scrolls. Here, are these stalls, are these uh, stores real? I want to go in some of these stores. It's sweltering hot and yet there's snow. It's, it's funny. I would say the park's just a little bit crowded. Just to show you, there's a little shaded area. And there are people everywhere standing around. There's not even enough seating for everybody. And then if you look past them, you'll see that, there you go, you'll see what, all the people back there. Okay, so now I'm entering Seuss Landing. I don't care how childish this area is. I'm a big Dr. Seuss fan. I grew up reading Dr. Seuss. It's just a part of my childhood, so I'm gonna show you around a little bit. Ooh, moose juice. Tammy, we gotta get some juice. We haven't, you know what, in Nashville, we don't have a lot of like Juice City or Juice It Up or whatever. We just don't. Okay, not only does it have air conditioning, I'm closing this. Can we close the door? Or? Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. Okay, entering the place. Thing one and thing two. I've been seeing those shirts everywhere. Tammy, did you see this stuff? There's stuff here? All right, I'm gonna show you guys everything, okay? So, a cat in a hat cookies. And you got gingerbread. And you got flip flop. They're called snookers. And these are like crispy pops. Rice crispy pops. Look at that. And then they have brownie pops. Oh my goodness. And then, oh, let's get shots of these for everybody. What she what did he say? Oh, my bad. That's all good. Okay, that dude over there just told my, my wife to get out of the way. Have a good time, have a good visit. Have a good time, have a good time. Argentina. Argentina. Oh, you? Uh, football. football. Good football, <laughs> yes. Good you? football. I am from um, Tennessee. Uh, Nashville, Tennessee. Oh, Tennessee. Yes, Tennessee. Tennessee. Yes, very much so. Yeah. yeah, how long are you out here for? Uh, how many days? Time? Uh, three. Three, three. Three? Three? Very cool. Um, uh, and you you fly home? Fly home. Fly home? Oh, oh okay, cool. Cool. Oh, I yeah. What is? What do we got? Very good. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got one too. Look at me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, well, nice guy from Argentina. I didn't realize he was from out of town. That's so crazy. He has plenty. Yeah. And then we got uh, here's your regular your Do you regular speak candy. Spanish? Uh no, you speak Spanish? Yeah, yeah. Muy poquito? No hablo español. Oh, I uh, you speak Spanish? I uh, yeah. no in a escuela. In a escuela. Yeah, tres. Uh, de años. Working, working, working. Uh, working. ¿Cómo se dice working in español? Uh, ¿En qué trabajas? Oh, okay, okay. ¿En qué trabajas? En, en qué trabajas? ¿En qué trabajas? En, en qué trabajas? Trabajas. Trabajas. ¿A qué te dedicas? ¿A qué te dedicas? ¿A qué te dedicas? ¿A qué te dedicas? Muy bien. Muy bien, pero ¿qué haces tú? ¿Qué haces tú? ¿A qué te dedicas? Aquí, aquí, aquí queridas. ¿Pero qué haces? ¿Qué pa, haces tú, tú? ¿Para qué haces tú? Sí. I, no, no hablo. I mean... Eh, doctor, doctor, ingeniero. Oh, oh, ok. Um, I do uh, YouTube. Do you know YouTube? YouTube. Yeah, YouTube. YouTube. YouTube.com. Com. Yeah, I do. I do cooking. Oh, cool. Cooking. Yes. Uh, I do a cooking show. Ah. Yes. Yes. Um, uh, ¿Cómo se dice cookie in español? Eh, galletitas. Eh, galletitas. Galletitas. Sí. Okay. Galletitas con Jack. Ah. Okay. 
on YouTube. Yes. Have a safe flight. Adios. Adios. Bye bye. Bye bye. So here we got all these good, all these goodies. Let's get a picture of that. Okay, and what else? Red velvet. Oh, red velvet. You want to try one? Come on, just one. Okay. Look at how beautiful these are. I just want to show you, and to think that I saw it on Mulberry Street. Happy birthday to you, Dr. Seuss sleep book. My, my ultimate favorite is green eggs and ham, the cat in a hat. Horton hatches the egg. Oh, I remember that. That's like a sequel, isn't it? To Horton Hears a Who. Green eggs and ham is my favorite. What is your guys' favorite? Uh, How the Grinch Stole Christmas is my second favorite. That's the biggest cat in the hat hat I've ever seen. Wow. And then they got, oh, this place is huge. Just the cat and hat area. They got a, and they got a goofy uh, merry-go-round. What a great theme, cat in the hat. I'm really impressed with this park a lot. A lot of things for kids, a lot of things for adults, and ICs. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I just got done watching The Avengers. Absolutely amazing. The best of all the superhero movies. That blew everything away. And now we're looking for a place here on City Walk to go eat at. Where do you want to go? This way? We came off of us. That's Burger King, honey. I'm not going there. Of course, there's Italian food right there, Vivo. Wow. Right ahead, Vivo, V I V O. Straight ahead, see the white lettering right here. Or we can go to Emeralds. He's overpriced. Oh, oh, you haven't even seen the menu. All right, so we're doing uh, Vivo, doing Italian restaurant, really nice.